The following contest is an Extreme Rules match. Making his way to the ring from the other side of darkness, weighing in at 420 pounds, TNT. All these superstars come into this match incredibly hungry to prove their dominance. I can't wait to see what unfolds. And now you have no chance of surviving here, right, Corey? No way in hell. It is time to face fate in the form of Brock Lesnar. The Beast is here. Time for a beatdown, cowboy style. From Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 295 pounds, Brock Lesnar! Brock Lesnar's been a dominant force his entire career. Brock Lesnar has made a career out of steamrolling whoever has dared get in his way. He truly seems to enjoy combat. Of course, Cole, because it's what Lesnar was built for. The battlefield is his home. Yeah, Brock Lesnar relishes the chance to go out and simply conquer. Because Brock wants to be on the very top of the mountain. And he won't be denied. If you're trailing in an Iron Man match, you have to find a turning point to even things up. Don't you agree, Corey? I do, and that means you have to have enough to keep your foot on the gas pedal to keep the match going. It is crucial to be able to create your own opportunities while minimizing risk when at a deficit in an Iron Man match. And you don't want to have to come back from a multiple fall deficit. That's a death sentence in a match like this. From the top. Oh, what a landing. And after that, you know things have just kicked up a notch. Pedal to the metal right now. In this type of match, Byron, how does a superstar combat against the fact that they could fall victim to a vicious and hellacious attack? Well, the difficult part is once an opponent gets the upper hand, you have to stop the onslaught yourself. There are no rope breaks, no five counts. Yeah, the referee's truly only there to count pinfall attempts and check to see if a combatant submits. Assaulting the knee with purpose. He's feeling the effects of that last hit. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. What impact! Brock must be phased after this string of action. You don't see Lesnar flustered like this very often. Now Lesnar looking for some momentum. Brock just got tired of being pushed around. He's likely more aggravated now. Oh, and that gut will take the wind right out of you. way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. And a third! Whip back into the ring. Strong takedown there. 
Oh, look at mounting it now. The oh. punch is hammering away. Ruthless. Lesnar on the wrong side of that exchange. Sky high! Way up there. This match is brutality starting to show on him. Still got a ways to go, but you don't want to let this trend continue much longer if you can help it. Vicious contact. That could be it. No, Lesnar powers out just before the referee's hand counted three. To do. This was the moment to capitalize on. That should have been the end. Butterfly suplex. Two. No, he pops the shoulder before three. Not yet. Gets him with the counter. Great job refocusing to reverse them. There he goes, right into the corner. And well-timed maneuver there. The close of this match is just ahead. This has just been an absolute massacre. Right now, Braun needs to find the form that has made him a dominant force. In full control here. Face first in the turnbuckle. Well, Brock way lays him. Knee right to the gut. And he'll leave the ring for this next stretch. Positioning it on the ring apron now. With the ladder right there, I'll tell you, bad things can happen. Look out! He moved, but can he capitalize? Counter after counter. Sleeper slam! Watch out! They're coming towards the announce desk! What the hell are you doing, Byron? Put in a position now. Starting to 
performs that upper area takes more damage. Getting up, but doesn't have a clue what's coming at him. From the top rope, multiple drop kick. And this is the visual evidence of all the destruction he's done to him. Keeled over, trying to find his breath just to tell the ref not to stop this match. He deflects it right back. Oh, look at the knee strikes. Precision strikes. Gosh, what a match. Last up with a well-timed shot. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. The stretch mufflers in. Couple of kicks will break it. Right to the gut. And now Lesnar continues to come up with ways to punish the opposition. Lesnar's a shark who's taking his victim into from behind. This one has to be over. Looking for the victory. Two count. The beast incarnate. He is not a man who stays down easily. You know, it's not exactly a walk in the park trying to put Lesnar down for good. What's the tally of how many times we thought this match was coming to an end? I can't count anymore. Brace for impact. Here it comes. The Beast Incarnate with a brilliant Has brought, delivered the exclamation. over how he won the top. How in the world do these superstars have anything left at this point? The arena's thinking the same thing. All eyes are focused on this moment. Yikes, that'll need to wake you up or knock you out. Stop to that. What's coming next? Taking their time. Oh, punch to the gut. I think they win right out of you. Big forearm. Boom, what a hit. Look at Lesnar. WWE Universe knows he's the most dangerous man in the building. Cranking the head. Brock clearly has the advantage here, guys. It is scary how much Lesnar enjoys dishing out this punishment. Into the barricade. Dodges out of the way. Side rush and leg sweep. Turning the tables. Arm trap. Burying knees into the bottom. Relentless. And he keeps his focus on an attack to that area. Any more hits in that area couldn't even dizzy. And attacking above the shoulders has become the strategy here. And more hits up there can leave you dazed.
Saved by a leg sweep there. And he tosses him back in now.